In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to open a Word document on a Chromebook. There are actually a few different ways to open a Word document on a Chromebook, and in a previous video, which will be linked to in the description down below, Timmy shows you how you can actually install Microsoft Office on your Chromebook, and then you could open a Word document in Microsoft Office. But in this video, Timmy's going to show you the more built-in, easier way to open a Microsoft Word document on a Chromebook, the way that Google intends for you to do it. So to do that, you'll need to find your Word document on your Chromebook. If you've downloaded it from somewhere, it will probably be in your Downloads folder, but it could be anywhere else in the Files app on your Chromebook. And then when you've found it, you'll see Timmy's found Timmy's document here. You'll just need to double click on it and it will automatically open it up in Chrome like this. And it will have a little pop-up window the first time you do it telling you about this. But basically what it is, is it's this cool built-in thing that's built into Chrome OS that allows you to open Word documents, PowerPoint presentations, and Excel spreadsheets just by clicking on them. So. Now you've got your Word document open up in your browser and you can, if you all you wanted to do with the Word document was read it, you really you could just scroll down and read it now, it's perfectly fine like this. And you can even make some basic edits to it. If you want to just add some text or change the color or something, you can do all that sort of stuff. It doesn't have all the features that you might find in Google Docs or Microsoft Word, but if you just want to make some simple easy changes, you can do that and it will be saved automatically. So after Timmy typed the word Timmy, it's already automatically saved that. So now the Word document has been updated. But as you may have noticed, this interface is a little bit limited. You can't do absolutely everything on here and it's just sort of not the best experience. But if you want, you can quite easily open up this document in Google Docs and then you get features similar to Microsoft Word where there's all these different features and you can even share it with people and do cool things like that if you want. So to do all of that, you'll just need to come up here and click on File and then click on Save as Google Docs and it will automatically open up the Word document as a Google Doc for you. So this takes about maybe 20 seconds to do that, just takes a little while to process it and now it's done. So now, as you can see, your Word document is in here in Google Docs as a Google Doc. So now you have a lot more features here, a whole lot of features really similar to Microsoft Word, but the difference with it being in here as a Google Doc instead of just having it open in this thing here is that now if you make changes to this Google Doc, the file will not be changed. So the Word document that we had in the Files app before will not be affected if Timmy makes changes to this Google Doc. And that's not really a big problem because the document will still be saved in Google Docs. So if you click on this Google Docs icon here and go back to see all your Google Docs, you'll see this document is right here. And also if you went to drive.google.com, you would find the document in there. So you still have it and you have all the changes, but the file that's saved to your Chromebook will not be this updated version with the changes you've made. But if you wanted to make some changes in Google Docs and then still have your Microsoft Word document on your Chromebook, you can do that quite easily too. You just need to come up to File and hover over Download and then click on Microsoft Word and now it will download your modified Google Doc back to being a Microsoft Word document. And if you open up the Files app again, you'll see here, this is the original document that we had originally that we opened before. And now this is the new Google Doc version that to me has made some changes to. So now you can, you might want to rename this or delete the original or something, but now you have your document. And you don't have to download it again, but if you wanted to re-download it to your Chromebook, that's just something you could do. So that's really cool. And that's all there is to opening up a Word document on a Chromebook the way it was sort of meant to be done. But if you've decided that you would like to open it up, open up your document in Microsoft Word, then you can learn how to do that by clicking on this video here.